about today is about wills and power of attorney. Now, how many of you have your wills and power of attorneys up to date? Well, that's a very, very important thing, and especially if you want to protect your loved ones. There should be two powers of attorney in place, one for your personal health care and one also for your financial affairs, and there should be also a will that's up to date. I would recommend that these all be done by professionals who understand the legal system of the country or the government system that you're in. Sure, there's a lot of wills and, and power of attorney kits that are available on the internet, but don't cheapen this advice. Don't cheapen the professional, professional services because this is a lifetime decision, and especially if you have a lot of assets in place. Also, you should let your loved ones know where these documents are kept. God forbid if something should happen to you while you're out walking on your way home and you get hit by a truck and, and you become brain damaged, that you're not able or capable to make a decision and nobody knows where all these documents are kept. So what you want to do is make sure that you have these documents in a safekeeping place and that your loved ones know where they can access them in case, of an, in case anything does happen. Well, what I like to say is take care of yourself, take care of your family, think smarter, don't work harder, but make sure these things are done because you want to really take care of your family because you love them. Until next time, cheers and have a great week.